In this senior group, it, we've had senior classes of 20, 22, 18 kids. Um, there's only 11 of them. So this is the smallest senior class we've had in over a decade. Um, but there's some great leaders in there. So some great kids, a lot of AP students. Uh, this is one of the more intelligent senior classes we've had. Like our grade, in grade in the past, had never lost going into that time. So I think it's something that we don't want to happen again, obviously. But um, I think we learned a lot from that. We learned a lot from our mistakes. We learned a lot from a loss. And I think it's important to go through and experience that situation to build off of it and learn. We were like undefeated for three straight years. So like no one liked how last year ended. And everyone's a little pissed off and ready to hit another team. Do you think that kind of got you guys going with the grind of the offseason? It definitely did. And then that way it fueled everyone to work a little harder. The offseason was great. I mean, we got a lot of guys putting in hard work. And I mean, the team bonding has been so much better than it has been the last couple of years. I mean, you can see it on the practice field. We're getting closer with these guys every day, and it's, re it's been really fun. You know, they did everything we asked them to do, and they look good. Um, I think they really took into account the the stretching and the flexibility and, and, you know, not just weight training. There's more core and flexibility that has a lot to do with it. And I think this group probably has done that better than some other groups that just want to lift all the time. So um, combination of like all the stuff with the bands and the jumps and the, and the, and the core and the flexibility I think is really going to help us. I think just how we've been playing with each of these guys for so long. I mean, I mean, friends with Phil. I mean, growing up with Jake. I mean, knowing him, I pretty close with him. So just growing up with these guys and playing youth football, middle school with those guys makes it easy. And that's the key. Like you know, being a real unselfish team is is you know the, the is what you need to be. Like you not don't worry about all the other little things. Do your job. We do have a lot more experience considering we played a lot of younger guys last year like Gino and Sale and Matt Cayley's coming up as an off awesome offensive lineman so I think we'll have some more experience from the younger guys which is great. This defense we're just ready to smack someone. Uh, we're just mad from last season and use it as fuel. Last year we started a couple sophomores a bunch of juniors so we have a lot of guys back and we're very experienced now after playing 15 games last year together so we got experience and we're all we're all pretty fast so it'll be fun defense.